welcome to our first 15 minute impression of Diablo Immortal. The first three minutes of the game, you are just, of course, watching some cutscenes, some background stories, and character creation. In this particular one, we created a necromancer named Bushind. Uh, <laughs> anyways, the uh, first 15 minutes in general appear to be just a tutorial of sorts to get you through the basics as you can see those little footsteps there the they kind of lead you along the way and you have the little quest on the side there they tell you how far along you've made it here's you get a uh, continuous saves uh, it saves by itself which is nice and like i said essentially you're just being led around by these footsteps they, the instructions on what to do if you are a little slow. I don't know if it's possible to die in this first 15 minutes. I have, this was the very first time I've ever played this game. I had no idea how to play it, and we made it through it. I don't think we came close to uh, dying at any particular time. Now, as you can see, the game I think it looks pretty good. One thing you may need to do, and I did was I had to turn up the brightness a little bit. Uh, my phone gets very dark anyway, so I had to turn it up in order to uh, be able to see all the wonderful graphics that uh, are a bit available. And one other thing that I want to do also is put in headphones, or at least play in some place that you can hear it. There is a lot of uh, mood sounds and uh, sound effects. So as you play the game, you know, I, the necromancer uh, <laughs> that we picked, I had, that was the first choice they gave us. I'm assuming there are many other, choice, other choices, but I don't, I'm not 100% sure on that. There are, uh, I did, after I downloaded it, I did notice some uh, Facebook ads telling me that it's uh, death and life. That's pretty good. So I'm assuming there are other others in the death and the So as you can see here, I don't come close to dying, but of course I have these two minions with me that uh, can do what they seem to They probably could have won easily by themselves. Which <laughs> is nice. So, uh, you know, you as you play the game, they do try to help you out, especially in the beginning. They I tried to destroy some equipment that was better than what I had, and it told me. So, it was a very nice touch. <laughs> hey, hey, don't destroy that. That is better than what you're wearing. Okay, thank you. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, I, I I still don't know like what what is good versus bad equipment. I don't know, but uh, apparently the um, you know the the program knows. So, as you can see, I think this is, this looks beautiful, this game, uh, I don't know how long it's been out, it's obviously been out for a little, uh, a while, and, um, the biggest complaints that I read about it, Diablo, Diablo Immortal, is that, uh, the skins, there's an issue with the skins, and, uh, I guess the, the gameplay gets repetitive, of course it didn't do that in the... 15 minutes that I was playing the game. It's actually quite uh, fun. But, you know, when you start playing something like this, I don't know, you can just play it and enjoy it and put it down and say, okay, that's good enough, right? Um, the game doesn't have to uh, be forever, right? I mean, it doesn't have to <laughs> have enough content that it will take up all of your time and things like that. It could just be fun for, for that time. So, you know, if you're interested in the game, you know, give it a try. It's 15 minutes. Like I said, the, the, the download's a little bit large. Um, there are some, uh, you know, they asked to be to get push notifications. I just said no. And... I didn't have to. It didn't like. Uh, it was kind of weird. It didn't 
it gave you the feeling that if you didn't accept the push notifications that you couldn't play but I said uh, you know I, I didn't allow it and it still let me play so that was nice uh, just kind of weird that the way it was set up but uh, yeah it's uh, you know, 15 minutes I think they, they probably have some uh, Online stuff we can play with other people. I don't get that far. It's 15 minutes to play. I think I make it to level 10. And um, now we get equipped. It's it's. This is the kind of weird thing. They make you, uh, you know, pick stuff up. I guess just to give you the feeling that you're doing something. As you can see, I just I left some stuff behind because I'm like I don't. I don't know, it just seems weird to me that you have to go through the process of actually picking, <laughs> picking stuff up off the ground. And I'm just going to leave that 10 gold there, 8 gold there. It's, you know, okay. You know, what if you, you didn't see something and, you know, that's, that's kind of hard for me to think about what I have to do. I request an online game a little pop-up box at least you know what's there. You know, there's a lot going on. You're in the middle of a fight uh, sometimes and you move and you might move out of range of the uh, items that drop so you have to go back, I guess. Uh, make sure you're not missing anything. So it seems to look like a bit of a time sink, but you know, that's a small portal. You know, I mean, when you're playing something that looks this nice, I didn't have any commercials, I think they are making all the money via skins you know okay now I don't know if those skins help you win or not um, but uh, yeah you can uh, you know you don't have to worry about uh, running into a commercial a lot of those or ad uh, there's a lot of that uh, in many of the games that you play where you're just constantly bombarded with ads oh, me. now um, like I said, I don't know if it's uh, pay to win either, so I'm not going to, uh, you know, say that doesn't exist. But I think that there's enjoyment to have in the game. And either way, you know, you look at the game as for what it is and what it has to offer you. you know, if you want to you know, experience different sides of it, that means that you have to pay. <laughs> You experience some of that okay it's, it's just the different aspects of the game you don't need to do that uh and it's all speculation on my part like i said i don't know i just read some complaints and in that initially it was pay to win but uh, maybe not anymore who knows i'm sorry I, I, I don't have that to provide but i do know that uh in the first 15 minutes it's a lot of interesting things going on and there you can see i actually uh i didn't realize how low i was um, um uh, it looks like the health bar is over there on the left. And, uh, and I've gotten kind of low, I suspect. I didn't uh, realize that any, any of my health was. Uh, you know, I wasn't paying that much attention to, to it because I was trying to absorb what was going on on the actual screen. You know, I figured if I died, I died. No big deal. I start over. Uh, But, uh, yeah, I don't know how many times it goes, but as you can see, there's these little health globes that pop up. Of course, you're going to get those. Now, uh, well, it's just like anything when you're playing one of these games, you've got to uh, learn how to play it. You have know, these little skills on the right. They do things, they do it differently. Some of them are actual. Uh, skill in order to go and use them properly, but uh, I would say, uh, you know, most of it is, like I said, in the first 15 minutes, you're, you're, you're not going to be in danger of dying probably, unless you're just doing something utterly foolish, like sitting in some acid or something like that, poison, uh, you know, you need to, you need to pay a little bit of attention when you're playing, but I wasn't paying much, and uh, I made it through. It does lead you through, uh, uh, you know, the dialogue. You need to go here. You need to go there. The footsteps. You just if you just keep following the footsteps, 
it tells you basically what to do in this client it says use the portal so I'm trying to click the portal in the middle but it's actually the portal on the right that they want you to click so you know there I just saved you one second at uh, as you can see the footsteps bring you to the person you need to click on the dialogue there on the right I think I was clicking on the question mark you know you just need to do dialogue and this is where you can like I said uh, get rid of your items and here this is the one where it's telling me hey uh, you're destroying something better than you're wearing <laughs> so you know that's uh, you know that was nice <laughs> it was nice to know that so I did play the original Diablo I didn't play Diablo 2 is it Diablo 2 Diablo 3 I didn't play any of those um, but uh, the original Diablo I played you know, this is obviously a much more advanced game, and, uh, and it's got some enjoyment to it. I just, you know, I don't know how important a story is in this kind of game. I mean, there's a lot going on here, as you can see. <laughs> I, I don't know necessarily if that's important. It wasn't important to me. I mean, I just want to go out there and battle some monsters and you know feel like I've done something <laughs> but the actual story behind it all yeah I, I can skip through all that uh, the gameplay is you know it's got a, a simple gameplay this is on the phone if you're wondering I have heard that you can uh, you know play on your computer if you have a computer but uh, I play it on the phone. It's a little cumbersome, you know, you got big fingers, <laughs> you're kind of covering up what you're playing. But uh, that being said, it's still, it's still very enjoyable. It's an enjoyable uh, experience. I will be playing this uh, again. You know, I don't know if I'll be playing it from the beginning or just continuing on with the Necromancer Bushinda, but... Um, I just found it to be, you know, a very pleasant experience. Uh, you know, it's right as what I was expecting. I actually, you know, I mean, maybe there's too much story. You know, I, I don't, uh, you know, just pick up the items and go and <laughs> start killing stuff. But anyways, I do think it's worth playing. I thank you for watching. If you want to see more of Bushinda, the Necromancer, or some more Diablo Mortal, just put it in the comments. Thank you so much.